Okay, chill with Maggie, and today she and I are going to be doing another review session, similar to what Nicole did with her. I hear that uh, Maggie might have be having some trouble adjusting to listening to commands on the harness, and uh, is forgetting some of her basics, so I just want to review those with her. Um, I have treats hidden in my pocket, and as far as I know, Maggie doesn't know that, um, and I don't want her to know about the treats because we know Miss Maggie will do anything for food, but to the point where she is with her training now, she knows everything well enough that she should be doing it without the food incentive. So, Maggie, can you sit? Good, sit, good girl, good girl. So I just kind of want to start back to the basics where, you know, at first, Lately, we wouldn't give her, you know, that much excitement or grace for sitting because it's such a basic thing that she knows so well. But we need to uh, give her a little bit more incentive, it sounds like. Maggie, sit. Good sit. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Now go. Very nice. Good deal. Good deal, Maggie. Good girl. Good girl. Oh, she's loving the hugs. Good job. Down. Very good. Good deal. Oh, down. Good deal. Good girl. Good girl. So with that, um, since she's doing good, just one-on-one, uh, I want to -on practice with a little bit more distance and see how she does there. I'm going to take the leash off of her because we are in the garage. She can't really get too far from me anyway. Okay, Maggie. Sit. Down. Good girl. Good girl, Maggie. Good deal. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that was good. Um, I wonder how she's doing with her cubs. If those are still um, doing well now, I've heard that sometimes you have trouble with that. Maggie is off exploring now, um, so I'm going to use this opportunity while she's distracted to call her. Maggie, come. Maggie, come. Good come. Good girl. Good come. Good come, Maggie. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so that was good. She didn't do it the first time. She kind of acknowledged me. I realized that was off camera, but she um, wasn't that motivated to uh, to come right away. Now, usually, you know, we do big, exciting, Maggie, come! You know, stuff like that, which she loves, good girl. But, you know, again, she is to the point now where she knows it and she shouldn't be listening to it at all times, regardless of how you say it. And also, when you're out um, in public with her doing your therapy work, you want, um, I don't know, the kind of people that you're bringing her around to, so you probably want to avoid getting too excited and um, too animated if the people can't take that much stimulation or something like that. Maggie is now around the corner of one of the kennels and can't see me, so we'll see how she does with the come now. Maggie, come. Sit, sit pretty, and she would, um, she remembered 
that she would anticipate it. So she would run through it before we even asked her, or regardless of what we asked her, she would do it in that order. So she really uh, picks up patterns and anticipates things, which anticipates things, which I think that's what she was doing when she down instead of sitting um, there. So let's try that again. Now you wait. So, she seems to be doing pretty well. We 
Um, she did her commands well today, so hopefully she continues to improve and gets back up to uh, where she was. Okay, this was Rachel and Maggie, and we were doing a sick uh, down-and-coming review.